Well, I started with a geography degree. So obviously there's a direct link between a geography degree and enterprise selling, right? Uh, same as most people. So I went through university, ended up taking a graduate placement job because it was paying money. It got me from where I was in the north of England to London and the bright lights and all that sort of stuff. And Sainsbury's at the time were good enough to give me the opportunity to, to, to get down to London. And so I started in an IT job. And as a result of doing an IT job, I realized I wasn't very good at doing IT stuff. And I was much better at talking to people and doing those kind of things. So as a result of talking to people, you kind of went, well, if I talk to people on a regular basis, I'm probably selling stuff. So that kind of evolved through project management into selling and yeah, kind of here I am. The thing that gets me out of bed is probably working at how people work and what motivates people. So if you, if you actually start listening to what personally drives people and then look at the situation that they're actually in, whether that's professional or personal, it's quite interesting trying to work out how you can be of relevance to them or benefit them in whether, whether that's a personal thing or a professional thing. So that psychology of selling is probably the thing that gets me out of bed to, to go and do a day job apart from the money. I stumbled across the bike thing again sort of when I was oh, maybe about three years ago. So picked up the bike and promised myself I wasn't going to take it that seriously and ended up taking it quite seriously and, and racing again. And then through that ended up connecting to a whole load of people that you there that, that, that you share some commonalities in the in the business workplace and then myself and a, a friend of mine had the idea that well maybe there's something in this and you can connect people around a common passion and common passion in lots of people's professional lives is golf or something similar and we just shared this passion around cycling and found that it was a very senior executive ride ride bikes so managed to build a small business out of that and uh we're going to see where that that sort of yeah. takes so someone said to him what did your dad do for work he said he, he would say he rides his bike for work because every morning it's five o'clock in the morning out of the door on the bike coming back and i'll come back from work on the bike you know racing gear on all that sort of stuff have you finished work yet now daddy so not finished work no well not that job i've finished one of my jobs but i've got another job to do and that kind of struggles with the fact that you can kind of be doing a thing that you enjoy doing that's riding a bike but that can actually be a job so Quite a bit of confusion for him on that front.